Well, we got a few offers, but this one that we actually we actually liked, um, you know, because it had the private equity component, um, you know, multi-billion dollar U.S. private equity fund. So they got capital. Um, they have logistics and trucking, and you know, the 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 company we fell under was one of the largest trucking companies in Canada. So it had aspects of money plus some strategic for us. So um, yeah, it ended up. It ended up, uh, yeah, we ended up moving, deciding to move forward and, and some similar, you know, values and outlook on business and things like that. And the one guy, um, actually one of the things that, you know, really resonated with me personally is one of the guys that actually represented, um, the, the large trucking company as, as part of it. So he was the one who was in the middle of doing the deal with us between like, you know, Daryl and I, the M, the M and A broker, the trucking company and the private equity. Um, so for, for me, you know, I, I ended up building great relationship with him and, you know, looked up to him as, you know, even a, a, a mentor. Um, but he ended up building up a business, a logistics company similar to ours, but, but a little, but different, um, but asset light and, and sold it to these guys. And, you know, it worked out well for him and he was still with the company five years later, you know? So, um, yeah, that really gave me comfort that we're dealing with a guy that, you know, has built up a business. He sold it, exited, it went well. Um, and so that, that really gave me comfort that these were the right guys to go with. Um, and and how did their offer compare? I know we can't talk specifically about sure. the offer price, but but other sort of qualitative attributes. Uh, how were their offer? How was their offer materially different than the others you received? Yeah. So the other the other the other offers weren't something we would have. There was only one other offer we would. Have. The other ones were like too low and things like that. It just it just didn't didn't make sense for us. So you and had we had some ball stuff that you had to carve off. Yeah, yeah, we were we were on an upward. That's why it was hard to even evaluate it as because each month it's growing, right? So it's like it was, it was it was challenging. So yeah, the the one company it was that we went with it was it was a it was a it was a fair offer. It was actually it was it was a it was a fair deal. The other one that we were considering was a, a full on private equity company. So no strategic in, in mixed with it. Um, and, uh, it was a pretty good deal. Um, they wanted the software though. Um, the software was a, was a big component for them that they were really excited about. So once we kind of weighed both options, we felt, you know, if we go this route, um, yeah, we get a hundred percent out of the operating company and then we still have our software, to do something with. So that's ended up what, what we went with, but the other offer was, 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 it was a, it was a, it was a decent offer as well. It was just, you know, th th this enabled us to, to, to keep, keep our software that, you yeah. know, me personally, I was, you know, my, my wife was really a big part of the process of building it and things like that. So it, it, it was something that, um, I, yeah, I wasn't ready to let go. <laughs>